Hi guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. This is Aishram Malayala. So this particular video is all about MIT Manipal Counseling 2023. So last two years also have made videos on this particular topic, and I have the cutoffs for 2022. So like the what are the closing ranks for each and every branch offered by each and every campus. So I have that data. I'll be showing you that data in this particular video at the end. So don't skip the video till the end so that you'll also get that data and you'll understand whether you are going to get your desired branch at your rank in your desired campus. or not okay so without taking much time let's get into the video and for all the work i am doing so you have to hit the like button to for this video and also do share this video to all your friends who are participating in mit manipal counseling so if you are someone who is watching me for the first time please do subscribe and hit the bell icon to get the regular notifications let's get in the video and get to know more about mit manipal counseling 2023 If there is someone or you yourself is attending for Joseph Counseling, if you are in need of someone who can guide you or mentor you, so we are providing the mentorship program to all those who are participating for Joseph. So it's a paid mentorship. It's a limited number of seats are available in order to join that mentorship. So where you will be having a twenty four into seven guidance from personal mentor, and there will be someone who always give you regular updates. There will be a WhatsApp group created. You can ask your doubts in the group or personally or through calls to me or the mentor assigned to you. So we'll all always available. so that you, your counseling process will be simple and you will not make any mistakes so if you want to join that particular josa counseling mentorship so if you take josa the csap counseling will also be free the price for this mentorship is 999 rupees pay the pay the price uh, with the link in the description fill all your details and pay the fee we will be adding you to the whatsapp group soon within 12 hours after paying the fees and we can start your counseling process soon so first uh, if you see here i have read the the counseling website of mit manipal so i will be leaving this link in the description so after uh, logging i mean clicking the link you can see candidate login is there admin login is there so like you can use your uh, application number for mit manipal exam and the password which you have got as otbs password and enter these two enter this uh, code and click on login and uh, continue for your counseling process so before we continue with the counseling process let me show you the details about a counseling a bit so that you will have full information through this particular video so this is the information brochure so they have uh, four campuses manipal sikkim jaipur and bangalore so uh, bangalore is a pretty new campus okay so these are the contents they have in this particular uh, brochure so these are the courses wherever there is a tick mark that means that particular course is available at that campus so you can you just uh, download this particular pdf you can go through it clearly you will get each and every information properly okay so these are all the courses available in manipal campus sikkim jaipur and bangalore campus so bangalore campus have bit less number of branches so eligibility criteria should have attained have a met rank so manipal entrance test rank 2023 candidate should have passed 10 plus 2 or a level international baccalaureate american high school diploma or equivalent certificate qualification from a recognized board with physics mathematics and english as compulsory 50% aggregate marks in physics maths and in any one of the optional subject so optional subject can be chemistry also so the optional subject must belongs to chemical civil computer electrical and mechanical domains so just check that okay counseling rounds round 1 2 3 online rounds these will be online rounds so last year they conducted five rounds so this year they are saying only three rounds let's see whether they are going to connect further rounds if the seats left or not so as of now there are only three rounds which are online and round 4 will be intra institute after three rounds if there are any seats left so internal round uh, shuffling will be happening in the same institute itself so till if till round 3 if you are allotted in manipal campus in round 4 if there is a availability of any better branch according to your charge filling in the same manipal campus they will allot you so but if there is availability in bengaluru or sikkim campus they will not change your campus during round 4 that is what intra institute round okay according to inside institute itself that's it. uh this is the counseling portal so here you have to register so choice filling will be through counseling portal only fee payment will be there on successful confirmation of course fee payment provisional admission order can be downloaded from the counseling portal once seat is allotted you have to pay some course fee then you will get a provisional admission letter and there will be one more deadline where you to where uh, you will be asked to pay the remaining fees so opting out and withdrawal from counseling process will be will be through counseling portal only so after getting seat or after paying fees if you want to come out or withdraw your seat that also you can do it from the counseling portal itself okay so this link is important i will be leaving this link in the description check out that so now coming to counseling schedule first round online second third everything online fourth will be intra institute round this is the run okay so fresh registration and choice filling you can register and choice filling so 
what registration includes registration includes you have to pay 10000 rupees as a counseling fee that will be used as your college fees again okay so that is the date is 14th to 20th june so today is 17th june still 17 18 19 20 you have four days you have four days in order to register yourself and fill the choices okay so registration include you have to pay 10000 rupees as a registration fee and fill the choices okay till 20 so 21st 22nd they will take the time for processing and on 22nd you 8 pm you will get the allotment first round allotment online seat allotment so you have to check the allotment if you get a seat you have to pay course fee first installment before 28th june okay if you don't pay your seat will be cancelled you will be out of the counseling okay uh, and balance course fee will be second installment you have to pay before 5th july so these are the two installments which you have to pay so if you are someone who didn't register for first round you want to directly register for second round you can do it if you didn't got seat in first round you can continue for the second round also and uh, modifying field choices by already registered candidates you already allotted you already participated in round one you didn't got any allotment so you want to change any options you will be given chance during the same dates 30 to 1st july 2nd july they will take the process second and third third july after 8 pm in the night you will get the round two result and those people have to pay their first seat allotment first installment fee before 6 july second installment before 15 july so round three allotment will be given on 10th july after 8 pm and before 15 july they have to pay first installment and the second installment before 20 july so if anyone misses the date any deadline they will be out of the counseling so these are the counseling procedure registration choice filling seat allotment course fee, pay, fee payment first installment and balance course fee payments installment too after paying this you will get a provisional admission letter then you have to you will be in the waitlisting and then you can book the hostel 10,000 whatever you are paying it is not just for counseling fee they will keep that as a refundable caution fee if you don't get seat they will refund it if you get the seat that 10,000 will be as a caution deposit so in the college when you join caution deposit they collect the caution deposit right if you damage something they will use that money so if you don't damage anything after the completion of course after four years they will refund you back that 10,000 okay so in case the candidate is not allotted any seat in any of the rounds of counseling the waitlist deposit will be refunded within one month of completion of all rounds of the counseling first registration is allowed at the beginning of each round except for intra institute so first three rounds first registration will be there for every round in the start of the council so after getting seat allotment if you don't pay 1 lakh 65000 on time that 10000 will be lost your seat will be lost you will be out of the council after paying 1 lakh 65000 and the 10000 before if you don't pay balance tuition fee that is 1 lakh 60000 so whatever money you paid will be refunded as per the refund rules we given by ugc and you will be out of the council your seat will be cancelled this is what it is okay okay now this is about choice filling and all you can just go and check it they have uh, given some links regarding the scholarships you can just go and check the scholarship eligibility details and if you get scholarship you can apply for them regarding fee refund rules uh, they said they will update everything on the official website of these pages so according to they follow the according to ugc refund policies don't worry about that so the, these are the checklist of documents they require during the verification 10 standard mark card 12 standard mark card tc or PC certificate, date of birth, uh, which can be the tenth mark sheet again, other card of the candidate, pan card of the parents, two recent passport size photographs, copy of overseas citizen. This is for OCI or the PIO category. Original document is required for verification or submission. Okay. So now uh, it's time for showing you the cutoffs. These are the cutoffs for last year round one. So you can see uh, the BTEC Common Counseling 2022 cutoff ranks. So these are the closing ranks. So for example, if I talk about computers, so data science and engineering. So it is available in Manipal campus and Jaipur campus. Okay. The closing rank in Manipal campus is 2,976. And when it comes to Jaipur campus, it is 35,449. If I talk about BTEC IT, so it is there in all the four campuses. In that, the closing rank for Manipal campus is 2272 and MIT, SMIT, Sikkim 34967, Jaipur 35523 and Bengaluru 1284, 12,843. You can see even though Bengaluru campus is new, uh, so the competition is high. The reason is Bengaluru is a high T hub. So that's how it is. So these are cutoff for round one. So these are the cutoffs for round two. So wherever there is a star mark, that means there is no change in the ranks of that particular in that particular round see 1784 is the rank right here so what is that course btech uh, computer science and engineering let's see here in round one so btech uh, computer science and engineering 10787 is a cutoff closing rank here it is 10000 
seven eighty four. So the rank is even bit lower than whatever they got in round one. So that's why there is a star mark. So there is no much change in the cutoffs of those those uh, ranks which they kept star mark. Okay. So if you want all these cutoffs data, you can just uh, download it from the link uh, provided below in the description. Check the link and you can download these cutoffs. So these are for round three. Okay. So I'll merge all of these into one single PDF and give you the PDF link in the description. You can download from there. So these are the round three. And last year I said two, there are four five rounds, right? So I'll show you these. These are the fourth round, and these are the final round five cutoffs of Manipal MIT Counseling for B Tech. Okay. So you can see you can say these are the closing ranks for last year. So for CSE it is 869 and CCE Computer Science and Communication 3709 for Civil 35630 and Biotechnology 16941. So compared to Civil Biotechnology have more competition here. Chemical 35111 and Cyber Physical Systems 21825. So you can just download all these cutoffs from the link in the description. So if you love uh, the way I'm providing all these cutoffs to all of you. Just do like the video, do comment down, and do share this video to all your friends so that it will also be helpful for them uh, in their counseling in order to fill the choices easily. So fill the choices according to the cutoffs or the closing ranks of last year. So so that you will get a good seat according to this. Okay, what are you desire and desire for? Chalo, that's it for this video. If you find this is a time worthy video, please do like, share, and subscribe. See you in the next one. Until then, take care. Bye bye. Jai Hind.